name's Emma, and I'm the jeweler and owner behind Emma Brooks Jewelry. So I'm a goldsmith, designer, and fabricate jewelry here in Portland. That's awesome. So what do you think sets you apart from other jewelry designers in the area? Um, one thing that's been unique about my business is that it's really truly handmade. So everything I do comes out of just a passion for the craft and loving the experience of making jewelry and getting to know the processes. Um, so everything is very much handmade in my studio in North Portland. It's all um, kind of created to cater to whatever clients I'm working with um, and an experience that can be really fun to like delve into how jewelry works, what it mm -hmm. means, and just create pieces that are really unique. That's so great. Are you wearing all of your own pieces today? I am. Yeah, They're everything's my own. Pretty. So everything's made with <laughs> recycled metals. Um, we take care to have like really eco-friendly studio practices mm -hmm. and sourcing the materials and awesome. stones. What is your favorite kind of couple to work with for jewelry? Honestly, every couple that I've worked with has been like <laughs> unique and fun in its own yeah. way. So the process really is just uh, very humbling and very wonderful to get to like be a part of that intimate part of somebody's life and like creating a token that represents a love between a couple that's always you know quirky unique has all these stories that I get to collect mm. so it's fun that way nice is there like a certain like style you would call your jewelry like yeah um, most of my pieces tend to be like kind of minimal um, somewhat geometric um, and I really gravitate towards unique stones. Mm -hmm. So we've done a lot with salt and pepper diamonds, with Montana sapphires, um, and couples who are kind of looking for something that can be like really unique to them. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Yeah. So if there's one tip that you wish you could give every couple, what would it be? Oh man, um, there are so many tips in jewelry. And I think because of that, <laughs> like my tip for couples is talk to a jeweler, um, mm -hmm. not just a salesperson, but like a real jeweler if you can. Um, there's so many things that go into creating the perfect ring that you're going to wear every day and you know are you a rock climber do you talk with your hands do you want two rings do you want one like there's so many things that can go into how a ring is worn how it's made that can really affect like its durability long term right. um, the sourcing of the materials and like how those align with your values and just like so many little things that a jeweler can help make more right. um, approachable less intimidating yeah yeah. That's a great tip. <laughs> well, thanks so much for coming out today. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. <laughs> You're welcome.